This week in the Catholic Star Herald. God dwells here. The retired priests of the Diocese of Camden who live at Sacred Heart Residence, Cherry Hill, say they are grateful for the facility, which in June celebrated a quarter century of supporting those who dedicated their lives to service. It has been a wonderful retirement here, and I thank God for every day, said Monsignor Harry Jordan, who has lived at the residence for nearly 20 years. Monsignor Jordan has been involved with the Sacred Heart Residence since before it opened June 15, 1997, having been appointed to lead a group charged with planning the facility's design. The initial concept was championed by Bishop James T. McHugh. It is great to be with my brother priests, Monsignor Jordan said, of living at Sacred Heart. Catholic Press Awards The Catholic Star Herald and the Diocese of Camden's Office of Communications have been recognized with 16 awards from the Catholic Media Association, including a first place honor for Best Diocesan Pastoral Message. This year, every member of our team of 11 received a Catholic Media Association kudo, along with several of our contributors, said Mike Walsh, Diocesan Director of Communications and Associate Publisher of the Diocese Newspaper. We promise to keep working hard for our readers, viewers, listeners, and all the faithful. And we thank Bishop Dennis Sullivan for encouraging encouraging us to keep trying new things to bring Christ's message to all people. New Journeys Priests who have faithfully served the diocese for years, some for decades, recently embarked on new paths in life. After almost 50 years as a shepherd in South Jersey, Monsignor William Hodge is home. Granted, he spent about 17 of those years at home, which is Atlantic City, where he was born, serving what is now the parish of St. Monica. Today, however, he can rest assured that his days of parish transfers are a thing of the past. Effective July 1st, Monsignor Hodge retired from active ministry. Looking back over his years of active ministry, Father Ernest Soprano says, I can't believe where these 43 years went. His retirement from St. John Newman Parish, North Cape May, became effective July 1st. Now residing in Wildwood Crest, Father Soprano is spending time visiting friends, enjoying the sand and shore, and looks forward to more spiritual reading and writing. Completing his six-year term as rector of the Cathedral of the Immaculate Conception Parish at the end of June, Father John Fisher of the Oblates of St. Francis de Sales wrote a letter to parishioners. I feel the Lord is calling me to accept leadership at a different parish where the Oblates serve. The decision was made after much discernment, prayer, and consultation. Starting July 1st, Father Fisher became the pastor of Our Mother of Consolation Parish in Chestnut Hill, Pennsylvania, at the determination of the Oblates of St. Francis de Sales. For these stories and others, visit CatholicStarHerald.org. I'm Dave Hernandez for the Catholic Star Herald.